Okay, we're back with, it is the way the dog feels, it's physiology. If you're, if the dog is sad and miserable acting, that's his physiology and that's what has to change. It, it just, I don't understand how these people say, well, it, it doesn't respond to corrections. They've been training it for five days. Well, what corrections does it need after five days? Yeah, if I was having this house built and they, after five days, said, listen, we're, we're going to have to correct the foundation. We didn't lay it right. Oh, my God, what? Yeah, we didn't do the dirt test and all this. And now yeah, we're going to have to start over. Or we'll just build the whole house on this shaky foundation. Yikes. So you're trying to get the behavior to occur as a default, understanding that that's their baseline behavior. Default behavior ends up being their baseline. That's what I do when in doubt, I just act this way, you know. <sighs> oh, hi, Kamal. So if you said, what am I working on? I've got her going on the platform and on that little footstool. Uh, it's a very stoic acting dog, but that's why I got the little love things. You're, the dog is sees the handler as not anybody telling her what to do. That's just noticing her behavior and rewarding it. A dog like this, if you start correct, there's nothing to correct. She's not doing anything wrong. Her normal behavior, I mean, she's fairly stoic. If you take her down by the water, I mean, but because the dog's been in heat, I haven't been able to do anything really with it, you know, as far as taking it out anywhere. But, okay, there she goes. <laughs> if you said it only went up there because you started going there, I never had the idea. It had the idea of even moving in that direction. He said, now they're all three acting this one. So remember, yesterday I started her going around and she's kind of pushing me. <laughs> she's just copying me? Yeah, she's copying. without getting them to follow you. They're not going to follow you. They're not going to follow you anywhere. Okay, so i got to go on this platform with the pager. So, I'm going to wait until she's gone. Molly, you're being trained on the platform. You said Molly needs the pager. So remember, you're always just rewarding. I just start looking at the back feet. Oh. Copy anything they do. I got her going all the way around, but I'm just, oh, I'm delighted to hold it. I'm always stepping off. You said, what about continually stepping towards it, rubbing the head? Don't do that. Don't do that. It's, but it's it's now starting to just stay on that thing. Even she doesn't even know why. They're, they're not conscious of why they're doing it.
So I was showing her her curves and just falls. And she said, well, seeing you is making her go over there. Kind of. She's good around the little dogs, though. If you said she's pretty much ignoring them, she is pretty much ignoring them. Okay, so I can get her on the platform. Watch, I'm gonna do the pager. So, oh, hi, ball. My little basket full of stuff.
so cute the way she does it. Molly runs over there too. Like, she sees. She sees. She doesn't kind of really move with you. Like, oh! Tries to double dip though. She's a double dipper. <laughs>